Hi, this is me again with Corel Raw Tips and Tricks. I just made a video about duplicating pages and I started thinking there could be a hot key for this. I don't know how often you would ever do it. Laser engravers would probably never do it. But if you want to write a macro, you could go up to your macro and start a macro and call it pages. And you could even say how many pages you're gonna do for, then you could have more than one macro. Then as soon as you start recording, select this, select all you wanna do, go to edit and copy, go down to plus page, go to page two, right click paste. Page three, right click paste. Page four, right click paste. Stop recording. Now let's delete these other pages. And like I said, I can't imagine anybody wanting to do this. So now we're on page one, we've got it recorded. We're gonna to go to macros and your macros are gonna be under tools right here in, in 2019 and above, it's gonna be script instead of macros. But right here, page four is a macro. I'm gonna click on it, I'm gonna double click on it. It made four pages with the exact same item on it. Now let's delete these, let's delete these and let's try it with a hotkey. If you do this a lot, you could go up to this macro and right click and assign a hotkey for that macro. Let's put the letter or the number four. It's actually got a, uh, you can't, there's a lot you can't use. Let's, let's put the, let's put the equal sign for right now. You can make up something better. Equal sign is not assign anything. Assign it and press okay. Now let's just get rid of that and let's hit the equal key. It made four pages with the same item on it. So if you ever had that, let's start a new page. And I'm not sure it's gonna work on every item, but if you do this a lot, this exact same thing, and you draw it out, I might even do a little research to see if it would do other items. Anyway, I hope that helped them a little bit, and thank you for watching.